Question 20. Four mixtures are added to four separate 50 cm cube samples of water and stir. Okay, which mixture result in a solution with highest pH? Okay, for the first one, one gram of aluminum oxide and one gram of aluminum chloride. Okay, so uh, for the aluminum oxide is uh, will not dissolve in water, so it will not contribute to the increase or decrease in the pH, right? So this one, okay, will not really give any effects. Okay, about the aluminum chloride. So we know that aluminum chloride is the uh, it will form the acidic solution, right? Okay, so it will lower the pH of the solution. Okay, so uh, A most likely will not be the answer. Okay, for the B, one gram of magnesium oxide and one gram of magnesium chloride. Okay, so we know that uh, magnesium oxide. Okay, after it dissolves in water, uh, so it will form magnesium hydroxide and it will be uh, around pH 10. pH 10. Okay, so therefore this one uh, we just keep in view might be the answer. C. One gram of phosphorus oxide and one gram of phosphorus chloride. Okay, for the phosphorus oxide, which is P4O10, when dissolved in water, it will form the uh, phosphoric acid and the solution is pH2. When the phosphorus chloride dissolved in water, it will form phosphoric acid and HCl. The pH of the solution also around 1 to 2. Okay, therefore, C cannot be the answer because it's acidic, it means it's lower pH. For D, silicon dioxide, it cannot dissolve in water, so will not contribute any pH change. And the silicon chloride, okay, when it dissolves in water, it will form white precipitate and HCl. And the solution also will be around 1 to 2. So therefore, this one also cannot be the answer. Okay, among the uh, answer, B is the best answer and the only answer because Magnesium oxide, okay, it will form alkaline solution around pH 10. So highest pH, okay, will be the mixture B, right? So answer is B. That's all. Thank you.